What's going on everybody, my name is Nass and welcome to episode 17 of my Road to Ronaldo And yes, I know it was supposed to be up on Saturday So I was chilling on Saturday at 5pm and I started editing uh, this video of, uh, of, uh, of today which you're seeing, seeing now actually And then my editing program decided to crash and not to open anymore so uh, I had to reinstall that uh, which wasn't working, so um, after playing around a bit, I managed to get it up and running uh, on Sunday, which was yesterday. So I edited this video, but it was too late to upload already, so I decided to stick it up for you guys today on Monday. And uh, yeah, I do apologize for that, but as you can see on the screen, boys, we still have the pack which has to be revealed. And uh, you guys, well, you guys have been guessing a lot in the previous video, and I do uh, like to thank you for the amazing support on the previous video. And if you guys can go for another 500 likes onto this video, if you guys could smash that, that will be absolutely awesome. And obviously, I will be giving away 50,000 coins to one of you uh, who liked the video and, and leave a random comment in the comment section down below. It's not going to be a question today, just a random comment in the comment section. And uh, yeah, let's see who we got in this pack, because as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, we packed the main man. And you might be wondering why is he not black Ness? Not black as in uh, his, his skin, I mean the black card in form Because he's in the team of the week today Well it is because I packed him on Tuesday You guys might be going like Oh fake 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 Photoshop No it's not fake because as you can see on the screen I am in my transfer list right now And there is he chilling There we go first owner packed on the 9th of December 2014 um, I was really <laughs> Really surprised actually that I packed Ibrahimovic because as I as I told you before it was just a free free order pack uh, which you get every week I think you get 40 of them uh, one every uh, every week and uh, normally I pr pretty much get fuck all and I just discard uh, the pack but this time I got Zlatan and I got very happy I mean he's not informed but hey I'll take it because uh, I went onto the market and I checked Ibrahimovic Ibrahimovic his price. And Ibrahimovic goes for roughly 600,000 coins, which is absolutely awesome. So I decided to stick my Ibra for 600,000 coins. And obviously he did sell for 600,000 coins. So we are roughly 100k away from 2 million coins. And that is my aim for today's episode. I'm going to be going for 2 million coins. Um, in this, Well, I'm, I'm basically going to, to try and reach 2 million coins in this, in this episode. So let's get right into the trading. Anyways, before we are going to go into the trading... I thought let's look up Ronaldo's price first because I know he went for around 2 million coins uh, when I started trading to Ronaldo but he probably went up in the meantime so I decided to basically go into the market and look up uh, Ronaldo his price and I was kind of shocked because he went up like 600k and he's around 2.6 million coins now which is well let's state it like this it's quite a lot so I need to get to the 2 million coins because I'm trying to basically end this um, Road to Ronaldo before the team of the year comes out because um, yeah, then the big players are gonna come out and I'm gonna be doing other stuff Maybe trading to team of the year Ronaldo who knows I think he'll be way too expensive to go for that But yeah, we'll see we will see and uh, who knows but uh, yeah Ronaldo goes for around 2.6 million coins So we have uh, around 700k more to go and I think it's possible to get there with your support, so make sure you drop a like on the, on the videos if you do enjoy them. And uh, let's get into the real trading now, because as you can see on the screen, we picked up a uh, Legend Pires. Because I uh, basically decided to go for the big boys now, so to make some more profit, to make bigger profit per player. So we picked up a, a Legend Pires for 625,000 Ultimate Team Coins. And, we went, and when, we, when we went onto the market, we basically saw that Pires goes for around 700,000 Coins. So uh, yeah, we picked up a pretty good deal, to be honest. So uh, I decided to basically stick up my uh, Legend Pires for 699,000 Coins. Only for 3 hours though, because... Uh, I basically had to uh, had to do more trading and it was in the middle of the day so I decided to basically only stick on for 3 hours Hope he would sell and yes he did sell and we went onto the market straight away and uh, I decided to uh, basically look for some uh, some legends So um, for this time I I went uh, for trading on the on the console just for you guys so you guys see basically what I do I uh, filled in the, uh, the uh, legend uh, league and I basically was uh, sc scrolling and I saw a Luke Luke. Ruth van Nistelrooy uh, going for around 1 million coins and I know that Ruth van Nistelrooy goes for around 1.2 million coins so I decided to quickly add, add him to the watch list and uh, basically started uh, bidding on him and uh, as I as you may have seen my uh, my uh, how to win uh, more bidding wars video uh, I, I decided to basically use those techniques but the timer was kind of glitching up but uh, yeah I decided to use uh, the, the how to win more bidding war techniques um, in this uh, in this basically uh, bidding war and uh, unfortunately, 
after a long time of bidding, um, I decided to basically not to bid anymore because uh, the profit would not be well profitable pretty much because I yeah, I would basically make a 5k profit and on this route for next tour after selling him because the tax is around 50,000 coins so I decided it's not worth to basically keep on bidding on this route for next tour I thought hmm let's go for it in the final second but then I decided nah it's not worth it to basically make 10k profit on a 1.2 uh, million coin deal so I decided to let him go and I found this uh, Pavel Netfed um, on the market as well for a uh, 590 star price and he goes for around 700k uh, as I r remember correctly so uh, I went uh, on, uh, on a bidding war as well and the timer, I don't know what was going on on the console but the timer was just glitching up um, it was basically jumping from 10 to 8, from 8 to 5 and then from 5 to 1 uh, so I decided to basically bid safely on the 3 to 2 second mark um, on this Pavel Netfed and um, basically there was this other prick who basically, I think he has seen my video because he was doing the exact same, he was also bidding on the final second on the on the Pavel Netfed unfortunately and um, yeah, when when the price basically went up to like 630k, I was thinking, wow, this is gonna go uh, on for a long time. So I decided to just remove the Pavel Net Fed and go on to uh, onto the web app trading uh, market again to look for some more legends. And fortunately for me, I did uh, find another Pavel Net Fed uh, on an open bid. I basically used the, the, the used the technique where you bid on the 29 second uh, where the timer does not reset. And, uh, and I basically did not get outbid, so I won this Pavel Net for 597,000 coins. And as I told you before, he goes for around uh, 700k. He went down a bit, because uh, as you can see on the screen now, uh, I went onto the market to look up his price. And he goes for around six, well, between six, 670 and 700,000 coins. So it's still, it's still good. But it's uh, it's not as good as 700k. So basically, I decided to stick up my Pavel Net Fed for 680,000 coins for six hours because I because I because I was gonna head to uh, university. This was in the morning. I think yeah, th this was definitely done in the morning because I remember showering and then slipping in the shower, and I basically hurt my back uh, quite hard. But that's not important now because uh, what's important is the trading. And now we uh, listed up our Net Fed for 680,000 coins. And uh, basically, when I was at uni, I checked my phone, well, basically the web app on the phone, and I saw that my net felt sold. So I was re really happy with that. So when I came home, um, I checked how many coins I had, and we ended up, yes, we ended up with over 2 million coins, which was my goal for this episode, which makes me very, very, very happy. So, uh, boys. This is where, I'm, uh, where I am going to be ending this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, then make sure you drop a like. If we guys can smash 500 likes, obviously, I will be giving away 50,000 coins to one of you. Drop a like and leave a random comment in the comment section down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you very much for watching. And I'll talk to you boys all next time. Peace out.